All right, guys, here we are. Dra Super Dragon Ball. <clears throat> Excuse me. Super Dragon Ball Heroes. We have four different episodes here. Now I'm just going to give you my overall review of this series, of this promotional anime for the video game that I believe is not really promoted out here so much. But only if you're a true Dragon Ball fan, you would know about this. And you know that... It exists. There has been many, many different um, clips and intros and things like that within this game that they uh, that they that they have out there. I never play the game myself, but um, but yeah, um, just to jump right into the this, the series and whether I like it or not, and whether um, it's cool or whatever. I think I think it's really cool. I think it's super cool. It's like it's like. Um, Every fan, fan's dream, and they just really play with the characters. They really, um, they really let the characters do their thing. But everything is so fast and so quick. You know, there's no really no not much of, of a storyline, um, because it is just you know it's just a game. But it is um, very very jam packed, of, full of energy. You know. Goku, Vegeta, turn to Super Saiyan right away. Not much explanation. Um, they just, they just, com they just use all the characters and they just combine them all and they use them. And and it's I think it's really cool because you know in the, in this in the series or in the um, you know the regular episodes, Dragon Ball Super, it's it takes a while for them to really get to the to the action. And and if you're like me, you're more you really like the action more than you do just the storyline. Um, unless the storyline is really good. Uh, the Trunk storyline is always pretty interesting. But but the, the action part is always like the best uh, part for me. I like to see the blast. I like to see the key struggles. And I like to see them fight and go at it. Um, and see the new transformations. So that's always really, really exciting to see with this particular um, review. You know, with this... Uh, uh, with Super Dragon Ball Heroes, and now I know I mentioned this before, and when it comes to Dragon Ball, I guess the only um, man, what is that artist's name? He, he, I forget the guy's name. I'm gonna put it up here. On I put it, I put it, I put it, I put it up here. I don't want to uh, just uh, butcher the guy's name, but I um, I love his art, and he he drew for Dragon Ball Super. And he's 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 drawn similar to previous artists from back in the day in the 90s that were drawing, and um, just very very epic drawings uh, that this this artist has done. That's my favorite type of art to see with Dragon Ball. It's just so in depth. It's so uh, intense. But when it comes to Super Dragon Ball Heroes, the the anime, the it's it's good. I think I think the lines and everything. Um, I don't think they really skimped. They, don't, they didn't really skimp at all when it came to uh, drawing the characters and taking the detail. There is definitely detail. There's a lot of different. It's a different art. Um, let me see if I could find the art. The artist's name of this uh, of this uh, of these episodes as well. I'm put it up there. And I don't know them by heart, so I do not know. But I will see if I can get it up here. If I don't, I'm sorry. But if I'm looking to get it up there for you, that way I want to know too. But anyways. For the most part, it's really cool. I like the way they do the lines. They draw the hair nice. Uh, they draw the characters. They they give um, they give the characters and and just this whole series or this these episodes uh, for uh, Dragon Ball Super Heroes um, or Super Dragon Ball Heroes. A uh, they do them justice, and it's really cool. I think they really do a good job uh, with the art. The only thing I don't like about the art. Is that it seems a little too, uh, just my, 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 it just seems a little soft for Dragon Ball. Um, it seems just a little too like, kind of like Pokemon. I hate to say that. I hate to even say it because I really love Dragon Ball, but it seems like just really, really bright and too, almost too colorful. Like they, they give them the shine. Uh, which is cool. I think they try to get I 
I love it when they, you know, like, transform. I'm not sure what you call it, but I love it when they do use it. It's cool, um, but I don't. I don't think. I think it, 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 some some superheroes. I think it's a little overdone. Um, it makes it seem kind of like a farm. You know? I just don't like that. You know, and it's like, it kind of turns me off. Um, but for the most part, the drawings and the anime and animation here is is good. But when it comes to like. Manga, um, things like that. I would like that a lot more than I do the, uh, I guess when it comes to the brightness and stuff. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's it's super, super HD and super nice and clear to watch. But I just prefer the other type um, of a uh, of uh, animation. But I think they drew the eye as well and everything. The artist here did a great job. Just a little too bright for my taking. I don't really like to watch them all bright. I feel like that does it doesn't really go with Dragon Ball. I feel like it's a little too much, a little too glitz and glamour. But I mean, I'll still watch it. I still like it, and I'll still always be a Dragon Ball fan until like pretty much the day that I die. And you know, that's kind of it's kind of sad to say that, but I don't want to think about dying right now. <laughs> but but for the most part. I like I like the uh, the super uh, the uh, super Dragon Ball Heroes um, episodes that have been out. It's really cool to see uh, Go Goku against Goku and um, uh, everything that that is happening. You know, just clashing all the warriors and using different dimensions and uh, really just uh, 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 making it a great great um, a great awesome scene. And if I did, didn't see that right now, I didn't see this before. It says the mightiest warrior, um, Super Saiyan 4 v- v- Vegeto, Vegito. Am I saying that right? What the heck? I'm, I'm trying to like, I don't know why that looks so weird the way they drew it. Vegeto, like, <laughs> no. I think I'm. I mean, I know you got Vegito, and then you got a uh, Gogeta. Uh, yeah, I mean, I feel like a mistake, getting so confused in my head right now. But Super Saiyan 4 Vegito, that sounds pretty intense. That sounds really intense. So this is like getting really crazy, the Mightiest Warrior. Wow, okay, this might just be my, my freaking, um, my, um, my thumbnail here. But, um, and my title. But yeah, yeah, I mean, but overall, guys, I'm sorry, I mean, going like on a different uh, topic here. But it is, this is, I am still talking about Super Dragon Ball Heroes. But yeah, for the most part, I think it's great to see everything clash. Them really uh, put time and effort for, you know, the meantime. And it's something for us to watch as Dragon Ball fans. Um, some entertainment and really, you know, digest and, and then take a look at. Um, uh, overall, if you haven't watched it, go ahead and take a look at it. I have, you know, I just have a couple pictures on here um, as I talk about it. But go ahead and check it out, guys. It's definitely on YouTube. Uh, you can definitely find it right away. It's got the, um, the English subs and stuff like that. But yeah, overall, I like it. I think it's really cool. Um, you know, my only problem with Super Dragon Ball Super sometimes is just the art and it's just too bright and glitz and glamour like Pokemon. Like, I don't like that. I don't like the soft look and just the bright. I like it more intense. I like it more um, stealthy. I like it more, just a little more edgier um, than just, you know, the uh, the whole thing with the, like, Pokemon kind of look. But yeah, overall, I mean, I think it's really cool to see all the Warriors clash. You got Trunks in here. Um, you got Beerus and Whis in here as well for a little bit, and uh, you got and they had Fu. He's a different character. Kind of reminds me of Trunks, but like a like an alien type of version of Trunks. Um, and su- he, he turned super, so that was pretty cool. He kind of like transformed, and his hair went up too. So I don't know if he took like Saiyan blood or something and transformed, but it seems like he's got some type of witchcraft going on too. So it's kind of crazy, but but yeah, that was interesting too. So. But yeah, guys, overall, and I don't want to just keep going on and going on and on here. Um, overall, guys, if you have not watched it, check it out. Um, I will be doing more reviews and things like that on this category. I do a lot of different things, a lot of different reviews on my channel, reviews of other stuff. So check that out. You might just like that. You might not. 
So if, if, if you just like Dragon Ball, um, just keep stay tuned for the Dragon Ball reviews that I'm gonna be dishing out. So I'm trying to find you know my niche which in here in, in, in on YouTube and see where I'm going to go. Um, I do a lot of other things. I do a lot of vlogging too. So check that out, guys. But anyways, uh, like and subscribe. Hope you guys uh, like enjoy this review and this talk. And uh, if you haven't seen uh, superheroes, you definitely got some some uh, some episodes to watch and keep up with, and you'll definitely enjoy it. And if you're wondering, you know, there's episodes like what the heck that that's Dragon Ball. I never seen these characters. It's, be it's probably because uh, it's from this uh, this video game, um, and maybe this e extra clips that they put out that you haven't seen go with video games and things like that, or even commercials maybe. So, um, so yeah, guys, thanks for watching. Like, subscribe. Till next time.